welcome to another one of my videos and this is a product review of World Camping International Titanium Stove that. Hopefully I've got the camera in a, a good little spot there it's hard to tell because this camera doesn't have a screen but we're going to review this today um, Give you some information first. This is literally, I haven't um, built this before, this is brand new out of the box to me. And I've purchased it, um, they haven't paid me or given me this or anything like that. Bit of information, I weighed it. It doesn't say, it's off Amazon, it doesn't say how much the thing itself weighs. I weighed it on the scales before coming out, it's exactly 225 grams. It's made from titanium, non-corrosive, comes flat packed as we can see, and it's apparently easy to store and extremely portable. Straightforward to assemble, with guidance provided, that's what we're going to find out. And um, Velcro fasten pouch included, well yeah it does. The Wild Camping International Ultra Lightweight Strong Titanium Stove is perfect for camping, hiking, picnics and travel. And we shall be the judge of that. I mean, it isn't very heavy, you know. Like, like I say, 225 grams, but it, that, it doesn't feel heavy. Um, let's see how easy it is or isn't. Get old. And after I've built it, we will make a little fire in it and we'll put my pot of water on it and see how it does. Instructions. Let's follow those. There you have it, built. I don't know how obvious it was, <laughs> but uh, that's the first time I'd ever built it. It was quite easy. And that was that hard to build. So, let's give it its first burn. Now, I have forgot fire lighters and stuff so I've had to uh, collect a little bit of bark let's see how it goes my uh, some of you Australian viewers We'll know of somebody who's a good friend of mine called Ken. Ken Broadby. I can hear him now telling me how I can't make a fire. He's right, I can't. Got some bits of leaves in there. Let's 
So obviously the idea of this, one of these stoves, I've never had one before, the idea of it is um, that you don't need gas, you don't need fine gas to use it. Those of you that are regular viewers of my channel will know that soon I set off to cycle around the world and I will be going to countries that don't sell gas more than likely. So I thought I'd get one of these. Tell you what, it's very labour intensive. And I think that will be the fire ready to roll. Right then. Let's see how a pot of water sits on it. Well, half a pot of water. My particular pot sits on it very nicely. Obviously you need level ground. But there you have it. The World Camping International Wood Burner. What do you think people? Let me know in the comments below. Not just what you think of this one, but the whole idea of these over a stove. And there you have it. Um, it's had its little fire in it. It's a bit discoloured. But it hasn't warped or anything like that. It's done the job have a little fire in it, cook on it, boil on it, all the things you would do. Perfect. So to round that up, um, it's one of those products to review that's it's not got any moving parts and stuff obviously. Um, all it really needs to do is be quite stable when it's locked together, which it is. Not warp. I mean, obviously that's only one to one use. It might warp over time. Who knows? But for the money, no problems. And there you have it. The review of the Wild International Firebox. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.